good luck. It's Pokemon Soul Silver. Oh, is that that game? Mm-hmm. How much? Fifty dollars. Of course, it's fifty dollars. Like the only, only Pokemon game that costs like fifty dollars. A lot of people like this game. And we are back. <laughs> And today we are uh, joined by our good friend, uh, Yen. Yen, you want to say hi? Hello to the audience of whatever the internet or another dimension of stuff. Whatever. And, uh, and today, uh, we're going we're gonna to continue the adventure. We, last episode we defeated Bugsy. We, uh, we lost the first time, then we came back. It was good. Ong has got a critical hit, I think. But now, yeah, we're going to continue on. Uh, I thought back because he was a boy, for, I mean, a girl for some reason because his hair. Yeah, yeah, and you also, did you have, do you have Soul Silver or do you have Heart Gold? I have Heart Gold. You have Heart Gold? Okay, so you have played this game before. How far I, I haven't beat it yet. I mean, not, not even the first yeah, love part, balls. which is... Like, Kurt just gave us Love Balls. I don't know if it's weird, but I actually do really like the all the stuff, like the contest and the Kurt making you Pokeballs. Alright, so... It's not bad. Glove ball. Helps catch opposite genders. Uh, does it nice. work for the same gender? Because uh, I, I never tried before. Oh, something's happening. It's the rival time. Of course, it's silver. Like, tell tell me something. They're the biggest jerk. Is That's it true? Different. The Team Rocket has returned? Well, you beat them, quite lying. Are you serious? Let's see how good you are. Do you like Silver as a rival? No, because he's just, just a jerk. He's a jerk? It's not like Ghastly. You want to see uh, them? Ghastly, yeah, although it, it, it takes time for, to think. What are you playing? Uh, Big Man Zero 2. Oh, that's why I saw the Capcom logo. Well, whatever. I'm dead. Then. Okay, so I'll be you. Uh, I'm fighting Ghastly with the... Uh, my... Ghastly uh, was... was uh, uh, my lightning? Who? Yeah. My what? What lightning? What? What? <laughs> okay, that was not working, but I think in lightning is back, so... Uh, could you beat them, I think? Alright, level... I'm not gonna level up. The, put a curse on this, though, but that probably won't be much of a problem. He's gonna send in Zubat. It's too bad, it was annoying to do that. Should we stay in and switch out, in? Uh, it's your choice. Let's switch out. Uh, okay, these are my Pokemon. We got Chook, Absol, Sukus, Rocky, or Cabbage. Who, who's gonna fight I, this too bad? I, I don't know. Choose one. Uh, Cabbage? I mean, that, that may be a bad choice, but... It was. <laughs> it's a level 3 Geodude. Really? Seriously? That yeah. Three Geodude? Yeah. <laughs> Why don't you have Geodude before? I mean, I love Geodude. <laughs> it's one of my favorite Pokemon. Is it? <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> oh god. You okay, yeah. Yes. I thought your favorite Pokemon was Cyndaquil. Yes, <laughs> one of it. Okay, we have Rocky. <laughs> Alright, this should be enough. Huh? Yeah, I went to the Bugsy's gym and he beat me. So I had to go back and try again. Wait. Yeah, he beat me the first time I went through. Because I wasn't ready, that's why. I just pretty much pulled him with guy. I don't remember. I... I think I, I just defeated him with, with my... Uh, Simple, uh, I don't remember the name. All I remember is his um, Scyther gave me a lot of trouble. So I, so while he had his, he used U-turn. He switched out to his Metapod, and I just sent out Onyx and just kept using Harden. <laughs> <laughs> that was, well, and, that was something. And then so then the final, but his like Metapod wouldn't use. Um, like Harden also, so then I'm like, okay, I got it, I killed that, and then when the Scyther did come back out, it couldn't do anything to me because my defense was too high, but then it got critical hits and killed me. 
to get this. Well, yeah. So yeah, that's how I I lost against Bugsy. This is a this is an annoying Bailey because he keeps using the synthesize. Uh, well, at least you have hypnotize. So well, I mean, not hypnotize, but kind of an attack. Well, Hypnosis. Yeah, hypnosis. Uh, yeah. You're doing good or you're doing bad? We're doing pretty good. Mm. We haven't Excuse lost anyone. Me. Well, we lost Cabbage, but I don't think he counts. Because he's just there for a uh, HM slave. Oops, shit. <laughs> what did you put? I don't remember. He has poison powder, which sucks. Uh, poison. I hate poison. I, just, I have Thunder Wave, apparently. I clicked this really fast. Uh, Yen, what do you think of the new Pacific Rim Uprising trailer? No, that... No, you don't like not it? Good. You really it, hate it? It doesn't look promising enough. Yeah, it's like... like do you, Like, the rap music at the end kind of really, like, kills it. And if you do watch the, uh... What is it? The, uh, the audio commentary of, uh... The Pacific Rim... You know... The, the director himself knows about Mecha and, and Kaijus. I, I think it could be interesting, but I'm really curious about why they... It, it just looks average to me. Yeah, it just looks like really generic. Again, I could get deep into it, but then you probably get lost in it since... Yeah. A pretty simple way to say it is the movement. Oh, because the well, the original Pacific Rim they moved really slow because they're really big, but in this one they move really fast. Which it's like a transformer. Yeah, it doesn't like it doesn't make you feel like they're these big monsters fighting anymore. It's not convincing. It make it just makes CG looks bad. Yeah. Well, another thing I didn't like was how at the end they're like, "Oh, there's there's something I gotta tell you," and there's just like one big boss kaiju, which I I like that that's there. That's gonna be the movie. I like that. But what I don't like is that they like they tell they you. It to yeah. You. What I would have really liked was um if like they hadn't said anything like to make that one special. If they were just like it just showed all like the action scenes and it just showed the shadow going over the Jaegers. It's like they're saying, "Hey, I don't care. I just want your money. So come to see." Yeah, if they just shown the shadow of the Jaeger, but they didn't say anything, and then been like, oh, okay, there's probably going to be some really big kaijus, and that was it. Then we go in the movie, it's like, no, there's not. The kaijus aren't that big, but there's one big boss one. That's the surprise that they want for the end, but they ruin it. Yeah. That's why I hate movie trailers. I just ex they spoil us everything. Can you say poison powder? Do you know what level this evolves? What level did the Jurisyndical evolve? Uh, around 20. Why 20? <laughs> I don't know. It's almost done. Almost. The uh, well, he's almost dead. Games for the week! Level up, come on. Alright, maybe he evolves this level. Useless! You only become. I didn't read that. That's why they like silver. I hate the weak. Pokemon, I hate to see them. They think they're big. They're alone! Stay out of my way. We're the ex <laughs> Mongols for the exceptions. Okay, we're gonna heal up. Potion. For real? Wait, I have potions. I don't know why I put it that way. I have one antidote. You may need berries, they're pretty helpful, you know? Do I have berries? No. I'm just gonna go to the Pokemon Center because it's just easier this way. I don't think anyone's gonna faint. I think we have enough health. That's not, why, the, why that's not the Pokemon Center. Oh! <laughs> nope. Nope. That's not the Pokemon Center. That's not the Pokemon that's the, Center. That's the gym. That's the. That's the opposite of a Pokemon Center. That's the Pokemon Center. <laughs> uh, 
fucking cherry grove in cherry grove i in a faulkner city i kept accidentally walking into the gym because i kept thinking it's pokemon center they're they like look, they look different i'm like oh god finally the center it's the gym i'm like no i kept going it's a... this is not the game boy version in the game boy version you could get really confused because almost all the building looks the same uh, also, Bells, to get this Onyx, uh, I need to trade some guy um, a Bell Sprout. So I went to Bell Sprout Tower because I thought that's what the Bell Sprout would be, and there were no Bell Sprouts. <laughs> this is this is an entire episode of me no. just walking around uh, Bell Sprout Tower shouting. The force is watching. Bell Sprout. Apparently, the better is not as ghastly. So many ghastly and retardos. Oh, maybe it's because you're going there at night. You know, because apparently the game is. Setting up at real time, so some of the events is based on time. Well, it's the Farfetch challenge, right? Mm -hmm. So sneak up behind the Farfetch, it says. Yeah, oh, this one. So, I this what one. do I have to do? I don't remember. It's pretty. It's been a long time. The Farfetch knows you, it seems to fade direction. Oh. You had to avoid. So they can't see you. Got it. I got it. Yeah, you got one. And there's. Wait, there's more two than one? More. What? Why do you have three Farfetch? <laughs> because, you know, they're like. picking ducks. The, the <laughs> duck. Ooh, item. What's this item? To revive. I can't wait till they start selling those in the stores. Okay, so... Where's this last thing? Mm -hmm. uh, I see you. You need to catch from behind. Who's telling me that? Your voice. Like, I, I see this... Girl head. Like, okay, so I'm just standing there. And I see this duck and it like runs away the inside of my own mind is like you need to catch it from behind. Or maybe it's the hoot hoot telling me that. He's getting tangled in the branches. Don't make noise. Do not I thought you don't make any noise. Well, well now he's looking that way though. So now I can grab this duck. They're just ducks. They're like scallions. They're like leeks. Oh boy. Mm -hmm. My far end fetched. <laughs> you found them for us, kid? Without that, we'd be cutting trees. We wouldn't be cutting trees for charcoal. Thanks, kid. Now, how can I thank you? Here, take this. It's HMO1. It's cut. It's pretty useful. Teach it to a Pokemon to clear the smog. Of course, you have to have the badge. That was. That was teach it someone. Okay, who can learn? Who here can learn cut? Boot it up. Uh. You can learn cut. Should we catch a different Pokemon to learn cut, or should we just teach it to someone we already know? Uh, it depends. I mean, usually I just have someone, some Pokemon just cut and just teach them cut. How do you get at... Oh, oh, there are wild Pokemon in this forest. I thought you could go into grass. You don't need to. Can Weedle this learn forest. cut? Do you know if Weedle can learn cut? What? How? I don't know, he's got like a little horn on his head. He can like stab trees. But how long does that take? What? How long would that take? Like, seriously. How small is a weedle? I, it's, it's, it's... I don't have that many Pokeballs. Uh, I mean, not getting into true real, but... Seriously? Well, I mean, also, this... This is an owl that's standing on one leg. Hey Yen, what's your favorite food? 
Wait, hold on. <clears throat> I have to do this every time. Wheel the hairy bug Pokemon. How you one foot no inches, seven pounds, one seven point one pounds. It attacks using a two inch poison barb on its head. It can usually be found under the leaves it eats. You said dumplings? Yeah. Okay, that's gonna be its name. What did you just name? I'm kidding, it's name is gonna be dump. <laughs> oh I should name it Atari. <laughs> Uh, I'm not getting any internet connection. Again. Uh, I hate my house. So why... I, 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 so they just buried E.T. He can't learn it, never mind. Well, you know who should play? Spielberg. It's a great game, it's my favorite. Publish it. I think... That's, I think that's uh, gonna be the end of the episode. We did nothing. I'm gonna save it. Yeah, Spielberg was just, just like, yeah, it's, it's, I, I played it. I played the final version. It's good. Sell it. And people were literally going up to the creator was like, hey, it's not your, we know you didn't do anything wrong. Best it's, part. It's not your fault. <laughs>